Welcome back to Crack the Windows. If you've watched part 1, you know we're diving deep into advanced power plant tweaks for serious gaming performance boosts on Windows 11. In this second part, we're tackling the finishing touches, essential settings that work hand in hand with the tweaks from part 1. If you haven't watched that yet, I highly recommend checking it out first, so you don't miss any key optimizations. Let's jump into part 2 and complete your ultimate gaming setup. Let's crack the windows. Network throttling index limits how quickly your system processes network packets. This can increase lag, so let's disable it. Open registry editor and navigate to HKEY local machine system current control set services TCPIP parameters Create a new D word, 32 bit, named Network Throttling Index. And set it to FFFFFFFF with its character F8 times. This tweak ensures the network interface isn't limited in data throughput, improving online gaming experience with lower latency. Processor scheduling determines whether Windows prioritizes background or foreground tasks. Go to Settings. System. About. Under Advanced System Settings, select Settings in the Performance section. Go to the Advanced tab, and under Processor Scheduling, select Adjust for Best Performance of Programs. This prioritizes resources for your active game, ensuring that it has all the CPU resources needed for optimal performance. Dynamic Tick helps conserve power by allowing Windows to pause the system clock when idle, which can cause stuttering in games. Open Command Prompt as Administrator. Type the following command. I had already mentioned all commands in description below. So just copy and paste. Restart your PC for the change to take effect. Disabling dynamic tick keeps windows on a steady clock, ensuring smooth frame delivery in games without interruptions for power savings. For gamers using dedicated graphics cards, optimizing driver settings is essential for squeezing out the best performance. For NVIDIA users, open NVIDIA control panel. Go to Manage 3D Settings, then click on Program Settings. Add the game you want to optimize. Set Power Management Mode to prefer maximum performance. Set Low Latency Mode to Ultra. Disable Vertical Sync, V-Sync, if you prioritize frame rate over screen tearing. Fine-tuning your GPU settings can have a significant impact on how well your games run, especially if you are targeting a high frame rate. For AMD users, open AMD Radeon settings. Go to Graphics Settings. Set Anti-Aliasing Mode to use Application Settings. Under Performance, toggle on Radeon Boost and Radeon Chill for better efficiency and reduced input lag. Windows background processes can interrupt or slow down your gaming. Limiting these via group policy ensures more resources are allocated to your games. Press Windows plus R, type GP Edit MSC, and hit Enter to open Group Policy Editor. Go to Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates, Network, Background Intelligent Transfer Service, Bits. You can set both the background and foreground transfer rates to 100 kilobits per second if you want to limit bits usage across the board. Though this will significantly slow down any processes relying on bits, such as Windows updates. This option allows you to set specific times during the day for these limits to apply. For example, you could set low transfer rates during peak gaming hours, say, 6 pm to 11 pm. And that wraps up part 2 of our professional power plant tweaks for Windows 11. Together, these tweaks are designed to take your gaming performance to a whole new level.
If you missed part 1, be sure to go back and watch it to get the complete optimization set. And if these tips helped, don't forget to like, subscribe, and let us know in the comments how it's improved your gaming experience. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming!